Hey guys, it's Overlord here, and you're probably wondering where I am. There I am! Yeah. I'm hiding behind the wall. Hopefully you can hear me. Yes, I am wearing a mask. I don't like to show myself on the internet, but... I think you all will understand why I'm doing it this way. Probably should have did that moon necklace thing a while ago. Yeah, I cannot see the camera on that. So if there's lags, in other words, I will have to split it into two parts. So let's quit fiddling with myself and get on with this. Okay, start from the back to the front. Uh, one of the first things I got was this right here. Lego Monster Fighters, the uh, Vampire Hearse. I spelled vampire wrong, that kind of irks me. That's already built, by the way, that's why the box is open. The box is open on this too, this is built. This is a Hero Factory Speed of Demon from the Breakout. Summer wave of Hero Factory, and uh, those are both built. And still in the back, we got some Transformers goodies, and we got a collapse. We have uh, first edition deluxe class Starscream. That is pretty cool. I like that. Whoa. And we also have first edition uh, deluxe class Terracon Cliff Jumper, so that is even more cool. Everything is fighting me now. Let me see here, what fell? Alrighty, you are a noob, and so are you. So we're gonna get these out of the way, so they stop knocking over the poor gargoyles act to figure I have. I did get some of those here. <laughs> So, uh, first one of these little sets is, uh, Lego Monster Fighters, the Swamp Creature. Uh, that's pretty cool. I did not build that one yet. And we also have the Mummy. There's a little bit of residue from the wrapping paper there, but who cares? Presents a present, no matter what it is. And then... This chap right here. We got Stormer XL from the Summer Hero Factory line. I did not build that one yet either. So I got lots of building. Well, actually, no, I only have three Lego sets left, so. What am I talking about? Um, let's get to the vintage stuff. You see lots of vintage stuff. Uh, and uh, let's get on with that. First is the one that kept falling down. Uh, Gargoyles Demona, Mitt in the Box. She was mean in the show. Very, very mean. Betrayed her daughter. She betrayed her daughter like three times. It's just not right. There's another one over here. And he is pretty heavy. This is Gargoyles Quick Strike Goliath. And he's blue. I thought he was purple. He must have went smurf. And he's got red eyes, so he basically went from be he went he he turned into it's Demona as Goliath, basically. They had a color swap. Now I have a bunch of loose gargoyles too, so I should show you those. I got a Bronx here. And the little glider. It's a little glider. And he's got a chomping action. How cool is that? I really like, I really like Bronx. He's, he's one of my favorites. And then I also have, uh, eh, gimme. <laughs> Brooklyn and his Rippin' Rider cycle complete. For the most part, Brooklyn doesn't have a sword, but I don't care. He didn't use a sword, but he did use this motorcycle. And it even came with the missile, and it does work. And the little armor attachment for the bike. So I really like that. 
I also have uh, Battle Goliath. Another Goliath here. He's missing his tail, but other than that, he's good. He's. I'll probably display this one. More than likely. And then I got a incomplete Demona. This is all it is. It's just the. It's just the body. And then I got uh, Ice Brooklyn. Ice Storm? Yeah, Ice Storm. I like this mold. This is a good mold for him, but it's kind of weird having all the icicles coming off because he looks like a freaking abominable snow monster, but whatever. And his wings are clear, which looks so cool, but he's missing one and he doesn't have his tail, so. Eh, no biggie. And then I have a quick strike. That is, uh,. Missing his wings and tail. No biggie. I'll just find another thing for those. And uh, then I got a Brooklyn. Same deal as Quick Strike and uh, Demona there. Quick Strike, Goliath, and Demona. So I have I have loose, lots of loose ones. And then I have Hudson. Poor Hudson. I think his leg is busted. The one that activates the gimmick <laughs> looks like he. Looks like someone swiped his sword and chop suey him. But he was voiced by Ed Asner, so I don't know. Is that all of them? Uh, yes, that is, I believe, all the Gargoyles figures. I do have uh, some other Gargoyles related things. So that's cool. I really like that I got some Gargoyles. Uh, and now, Skeleton Warriors, you see that logo here, but I also got two other ones. I opened them. I opened the heroes, basically. I got a Grim Skull. Kind of looks like a combination of Spawn and old Skeletor. <laughs> so he's pretty cool. He's got a launching missile, but I don't want to damage my iPad screen, so I will not shoot that. <laughs> then I also have a Prince Lightstar. I don't know if this is the variant, because he has a purple gem. I thought he had a blue one or a red one originally. I don't know. And he dropped his gun. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Prince, uh, Floppy Hand, should call him. So, there's the blaster. And I do have some more accessories. I did not get those loose. I opened those. All the skeleton warriors were in the box, so that is awesome. And then there's some weapons, a skeleton tracker. I got a couple of those. Right there. Vintage goodness. And then Lightstar came with a little shank. <laughs> came with a little shank. And then, uh, got a little skeleton dog with Grim Skull, so that's cool. I'm gonna check the time. Okay. So, uh, I should be able to show you all the Skeleton Warriors stuff before this is over, but the figures that are mitt in the box still, I got, uh, Cyborg, yep, Dr. Cyborg, he looks cool, he kind of looks like Terminator, it's and I also got, uh, Dagger, Skeleton Warrior's dagger, he's pretty cool. And... Oh, 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 oh. I want that to fall. That would suck. Skeleton Warrior's Oracula. I really wanted this one. He is so cool. And then, I didn't think it would have gotten any better than that. I got this. The Skull Cycle. How cool is this? I hope you know, I'm gonna review this stuff. I mean, the gargoyles, obviously. I've been waiting to review some of these things for a while. And the Skeleton Motorcycle is no exception. I'm gonna save these for another video. But I also got some little things here. 
uh, in my spot where I left some cookies for a certain somebody. The uh, better show you individually. The Christmas uh, slug zombies. These things are freaking awesome. A reindeer zombie. Crap. Dropping them all over the place. I got nutcracker zombie. Santa Claus, and I think this is an elf. Yep. The elf. I will review these too, most likely. I did not get those loose, I got them in the three packs, but everyone's seen the humans already. And now some Transformers I opened. I got a first edition Viacon, who was actually easier than I thought to transform. So, that's cool. I got Knockout. I really like Knockout more than I thought I would. Knockout. And I also got Dead End, who I will agree with the my pals, he does look like a combination of Bane and uh, Spawn. I will admit that. So yeah, I am going to come over there. And uh, let you guys know that this isn't the end of the hall. No, no, as you can see there's plenty more left. So I'm going to stop once uh, Alice is done singing here and uh, make a second part to this. Um, I don't know how you guys make such quick hauls, but I can't do that, so... Yeah, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the first part of the haul. It was vintage Christmas this year. Vintage and Transformers and Skylanders. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you all later.